My name is Amy Kurtz. I'm the author of the best-selling book, Kicking Sick, your go-to guide for thriving with chronic health conditions. I'm a health and wellness coach and a motivational speaker. So I was always a really lively kid. I never wanted to miss out on anything. I was totally healthy and fine. And then when I was 14 years old, I very suddenly developed debilitating back pain. One day I just went to get my math textbook off the floor to like run back to dance rehearsal. And at that moment, I felt a shooting pain go up my spine. I had never felt anything like it and I wasn't sure what was happening, but I knew that it was serious. So that sent my parents and I on this long, windy journey of trying to figure out what was causing the pain and what the root cause of it was. I went to so many specialists, I saw so many different doctors and not one could tell me what the root cause of it was or say that it was food related. So unfortunately, in the 90s, the answer was to put me on some pretty heavy duty pain management medicine. And I lived basically on them for a good 10 years without any answers. And it really became a part of who I was. I was always in pain. I was always aware of feeling uncomfortable. The medicine worked for a while, but it just numbed everything. It wasn't an answer to the problem. So then when I was 25, I took a trip abroad. I went to Israel and I picked up a parasite infection and it's as intense as it sounds. I gained 30 pounds in 30 days. My thyroid shut off. My hair was falling out in clumps. I couldn't keep food down. I couldn't go to the bathroom. I had a system down and it was really intense and so scary to be a young woman and feel literally like you're dying. And so I went back to what I knew. I went to a bunch of Western medicine specialists and I went to probably 10 different colon doctors. I was to the point where I was so frustrated and desperate for an answer. I've done every possible GI test, like every possible test you could ever think of probably three times because each doctor wanted to run their own set of tests. There was nothing coming up on these tests. And the answer that was given to me was, your colon's not working, I have no idea why, you should just remove it. 